Dear brothers and sisters, all this information and knowledge is shared with you with a prime ordeal and a very honest intention to just develop a subtle balance within your instrument so that you get connected to the divine consciousness param chaitanya the universal mother energy or adi shakti whatever your perception perceives it to be it is just a collection of all my experiences and knowledge and uh, also understandings understood by the study of various objects elements and people and perceptions cultures which were conceived by my own understanding are all together put and i will request everybody to follow all the cleansing methods and everything with a very discreet mind you should have a proper discrimination uh, you should judge it with the voice of your inner soul of your inner consciousness of your inner vibrations and uh, you should not um, go frantic with uh, creating anything around you but you should uh, develop a sensitivity of right and wrong and there is no intention to shun any medical science or any living person or death or anything which exists around it is just an intention that what was my understanding in my heart um, and all this data which has been compiled and is shared with you the prime intention is that you become a devotee of god you start believing if you are a believer then you should follow if you do not believe in it so just keep out of it but the main intention is that you all come to the consciousness of loka samasta sukhino bhavantu that is universal prayer for healing all serving all loving all and um, i will also request everyone to understand this that you have to do it with all love care compassion and utmost faith in god in his blessings in the divine consciousness and that's what is the main objective is to motivate you to turn from an animal consciousness to divine consciousness so i am not here to prove that all this data or the concept of avatar or something which is frictional or imaginative but i am here to prove that you all are born out of that divine seed of energy and you are divine so you just need to know that shrimata ji is incarnation and her blessings flow around but at the same time when you take atma sakshatkara you each person as you come from the same mother you possess the same blessings inside you it's just that you have to awaken and feel it and that is only the prime intention of doing all this and um, you have to understand it with your heart with your mind you have to tally all the data with shrimata ji's lectures you can tally it with your doctors you can tally it with all the senior members with your friends uh, and do it with all the discreet understanding of right and wrong with complete consciousness um, and understanding of what you are actually doing or listening or following